Proses. proses all this thing is a process faham tak? benda ni kalau kita ada sequential of step and sequential of everything involved kita tapi kita kena in order all the which one first which one first that's what we learn in this course kita learn about process okay kalau people ask you what is design everything that is a process is a process okay Ha, ini mungkin you punya new punya knowledge lah eh Before this you cakap a lot of things Pasal you you guys give me very very brilliant punya answer I like it macam you guys nampak macam final year punya student eh Macam you mature saya tengok Tapi I give you I cantikkan lagi eh Mempercantik lagi It's a process eh benda tu Kalau kita cakap design is a process Actually design ni kita learn about process eh Pasal dalam proses ni involve everything Tapi which come first Make sure it in sequential Make sure which come first Macam it involve So either kah kita go for generate idea dulu No actually no Kita ada kalau I give you design project Terus you generate idea Actually that's a no Yeah it involve It will be there You will generate ideas You will do planning You will do change current question Yeah you will do this You will do this, you do this. Tapi which one first Ah, uh, That's why we have gonna equal the process This all we call process Actually design is a Process. Eh? Design is a process. Process. Everything that involved to, kita call it process. Sequential of step we will, we will do. Eh? To to when we involve dengan design. Eh? That we call is a process. Design is a process of solving problem. You are right. Eh? Solving. To try to solve the problem. And this is my way of interpret design. Eh? Design is a process of solving problem. Macam tadi you ada word macam kita involve Actually in design process kita try to solve problem When I give you design project actually you want to solve the problem To satisfy the customer need Macam you cakap tadi good And determine the customer needs Kita satisfy the customer need Because design normally kita design customer product Based on market requirement So design is process of solving problem By Okay tambah sikit By generating Kita generate apa? Apa kita jalan? When kita design, kita produce what? Dalam banyak-banyak word. Product. Kita, product, yeah, yeah, of course. One product. At the end, kita end up dengan one product. Kita generate apa tadi saya cakap? You do sketching, you invent. Tak apa nama? Apa nama that one? You create something. Apa nama tu? Uh, yeah, Idea. Concept. Yeah, you ada five team members. Kan? Five member each one of you must produce concept. Yes. Must produce ideas by generating idea. Nampak tak? I didn't put singular. Can you see as... What is this S mean? Plural kan? Plural. Plural. It's not one idea. Pasal you are five team member. Kalau five team member working, five team member working only one idea is totally waste. It mean you tak follow design. It's not good. So, design is a process of solving. Memang of course, when we give you project, you want to solve a problem. Eh? Any design task, design project give you, you want to solve problem. To solve ni lah. Eh? Solve problem by generating ideas. Or we can call it concepts. Same thing. S, plural. It means you can produce a lot of ideas. Uh, that's why you involve a lot of sketching. Each one of you can produce macam tiga concepts. Uh, that's the best. One concept pun still not enough sebenarnya. Katakan one team have five members. You have at least one lah. At least one idea. You have to produce five concepts. So that's why design is a process of solving problem by generating ideas. You can produce a lot because kalau you produce only one idea, can, how can you find the best solution? Kalau you have five ideas, you will evaluate all that five ideas generated by each team member. You have five of you, then you will evaluate through, through steps here, other, other method here. Then you find the best solution. You will evaluate the eh, concept, concept through filtering, 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 then you, which one is the champion. Uh, that is... Best, that's what I Find the best. Plus, are you listening? Line putus. Eh? Design is a process of solving problem by generating ideas or concept and find the best. Nampak tak? Solution. Yeah. solution. Find solution. Yeah, good. Kalau you pergi interview, job interview, ini cara you jawab. Oh, budak ni memang belajar design. Bagus lah. <laughs> 
Dapatlah masuk kerja lah dapat. Kalau kadang-kadang orang cakap what is design ha, Banyak eh you were fresh uh, graduate eh, apply, uh, What is design um, uh, Design uh, you, you sketch you do something uh, Tak boleh lah dia tak nak jawab macam tu tak boleh Kalau you cakap fluent dia cakap Design is a process Of solving problem By generating lot of ideas uh, Macam tu dia cakap eh? And find the best solution Oh, dia cakap dengan macam ni dia tengah oh, dia tabik lah terus awak dapat kerja insyaAllah lah macam tu alright itu cerita design eh that is about design alright ok kalau you tengok in my slide ni dia ada sketching lah yang cakap dalam design itu you produce a lot of idea you do more sketching eh you I ada mention dalam uh, dalam whatsapp kan I cakap beli pencil ada ya? Eh? ada yang lambat join whatsapp group ke eh? uh, ada sir ada beli dah? Dah beli ke belum? Pensel belum. Orang kena buat sketching eh. You do a lot of sketching. Pensel ni keras. Beli tak bawa. Tak main pensel. Dah beli dah? Yes sir. Siapa yang baru join WhatsApp group ni. Uh, remember early I ada mention eh. Last week uh, to buy pensel. You kena. Itu je you punya tool saja. You kena buy pensel and lot of uh, sketch paper lah. Uh, Initially you can use A4 tapi A3 lah you boleh boleh you submit over you sketch in A3. Pencil ni like this guys eh. Saya ada tiga set. H3B, satu yang gelap 9000 series paper caster. Bukan dia tak main pensel biasa eh. Ah jangan mechanical pencil guys eh. Jangan buat saya terkejut eh. Kalau buat sketching pakai mechanical pencil saya minum air tersembur saya dengar eh. Tak kena lah. 9000 series. Dah beli ke belum ni? Nampak 9000 series. 9000 series. Mana ni? Can you see my video? 9000 series. Nampak? Tak nampak. 9000 series. Ni 9000 series. Ini sketching pencil guys. Ini bukan wooden pencil. Sketching pasal. Pasal kalau you pakai wooden pencil yang common one that you use in your high school semua. No, you will not appreciate sketching. Pasal you can feel the difference, the smoothness, the pressure, dia punya quality of the lab. Yeah, so you can produce nice sketching lah, yeah, nice sketching. So make sure you have uh, 9000 series. I put to one set satu kotak. It's just good kalau you have set one kotak, it's okay. Kalau katakan you tak nak beli one kotak, you buy at least three lah. One is uh, 8B yang darker. B is stand for boldness and darker. HB no, not HB. HB to hardness guys, it's not dark. HB to hardness, stand for hardness. Hardness plus bold tapi still not dark. 8B, just B saja. 8B tu mean for bold, boldness eh. Katakan you already buy HB, tak apa, it's okay. You buy another one, just tak boleh nak to buy one set. You go to stationery shop like Booktop. Um, I don't know, at your place, at here we have Booktop, Rainbow, Kiang. At your place, kalau you can, stationery shop. Not not common retailer shop, tak ada. Kadang-kadang cik biasa, tak ada guys. Yang stationery, yang fokus on stationery. You cakap, get me the Faber Castle 9000 series. Dia, it cost you, one pencil ni cost you 2 ringgit. 2-3 ringgit eh, one pencil you get 8B and satu lagi you got uh, medium tone it's maybe 6B or kalau the, the the larger the value mean the more darker and boldness and B stand for boldness the middle one you must have something like 5B or 4B and you have the light tone is HB uh, nanti untuk your sketching lah kalau not today kalau boleh I want to explain today ataupun maybe tomorrow eh tomorrow kita focus on sketching ok uh, alright Mesti ada end nice eraser lah eh. Mesti ada eraser. Eraser, eraser. Apa-apa yang nice paper custom eraser. Okay lah eh. And A3 lah. A lot of paper lah. A4, A3 paper. You will do sketching. Pasal you produce a lot of ideas kan. Kita generate ideas. Kan eh. Proses solving problem by generating ideas. So ideas you generate not by computer but using laptop. You know. Not by your handphone. By sketching on paper. Eh? You mean you have to easy assess a lot of paper and nice sketching pencil. Not common pencil, not mechanical pencil. Eh? Sketching pencil yang 9000 series tu yang cakap. Eh? Kalau you pakai pencil berhasil, no. You tak appreciate. Eh? You punya sketching quality will not be good. Eh? Make sure you have that kind of pencil. Kalau you cannot buy one set, three saya cakap. Satu darker, middle tone and low tone. Eh? 8B, 5B and maybe one is 2B or 2B okay lah or HB.
Lain betul lagi. Sorry, saya punya lain macam ni kadang-kadang. You inform me. Okay. If you look on my slide. Class, can you see the PowerPoint? Boleh, sir. Okay. Okay, if you look on this uh, this gambar ni, ini adalah, it's a product. Pasal you will design a product, guys. Eh? I show you, it's typical handphone je lah. Eh? Okay, typical handphone. Eh? Common lah, common handphone right now. It's a product. Eh? Kalau, if, can you, if you look on this product, what you can tell about it? Eh? Apa involved when you design this product? Plus, to design this handphone, apa involved? Apa feel yang involved? If you want to to produce handphone. Simple. Apa feel? I mean, apa Material. apa feel? Engineering ke, architecture ke, science ke? What type of, what type of um, feel? Bidang, bidang. Mechanical yeah, engineering. Apa? Let, let me write. It. Apa yang cakap? Material engineering. 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 Oh, engineering. engineering. Material lah. Eh? Yes. Engineering. Engineering ada banyak. Civil ke, electrical ke? I think mechanical. it's mechanical and electrical. Mechanical kan? Bukan mechanical, electrical. Ada civil ya? You have civil engineering ni? Software engineering. Ya, yeah, software engineering. Ya, yeah, you are right. Software engineering involved. Apa lagi? Apa dia? Not just engineering guys. Apa lagi? Banyak ni? Eh? Apa? Banyak bidang eh? Saya shortcut je eh? Banyak bidang eh? Apa yang involved? Let's click. Okay, design whatever product ni, that's why you as a team. They are team of five, you cannot. Then in design, you cannot be alone. Eh? You cannot be alone. You cannot be single. You must a team member. When you involve dalam industri in design, you must involve as a team. Design, you strong as a team. Pasal company ni, organisasi is a teamwork. You cannot be singular. Eh? Cannot be single. You tak boleh. Kalau you alone, you want to design, you cannot. You must have a teamwork. Because they must be disciplined. Eh? One of you is expertise on certain area. So that's why each group consists of five students, right? So each one of you make sure expertise on one area. So you cakap saya, we might have a problem because we are all in the same field. We all mechanical engineer. No, what I'm talking about your minor project nanti. I understand. Tetapi industri actually, when you design a product lah phone ni, we involve a lot of things. Some of you mungkin cakap kalau tengok, you point out electrical kan? Some of you cakap electrical engineer first for this handphone. Electrical engineering. Actually, number one, eh, it's not eh, multidisciplinary. Number one priority is not electrical, mechanical. Eh? You might be surprised. Eh? It's a handphone is more electronic. Why is it mechanical first priority? No, mechanical governs semua sekali. That's why you ambil course mechanical engineering. So, you make the right choice. Mechanical is everything. It involves everything. Not just mechanical involves engine, gear, all screw. No, mechanical is everything. The physical product, the manufacturing of it, the material of it, everything. That is mechanical engineering. Everything, even the mechanism also mechanical. Mechanical is everything, eh? So you guys make a right choice. Lah. Your field is mechanical. Second, then we go for electrical engineering, multi -nation. So you, your team member, for example, must have electrical. We need electrical engineering. Why? Because of the dalam phone ni, the product is more like we have electrical is if dia punya apa? Dia punya not the software, not the OS. The electrical engineer is more dia punya dia punya power system dia, what battery kita pakai, dia punya circuit dia, eh? dia punya circuit board dia di on so any any device, any electronic product, dia design dia punya layout of dia punya architecture of dia punya circuit, eh? dia punya power consumption, dia punya resistance semiconductors, that electric engineer dia design the circuit, dia punya flow of dia punya, all semiconductors are all about, all about electronics, ok electrical and electronic engineering and we have field of manufacturing and even manufacturing pun under mechanical right? and manufacturing to manufacture the product ha, kita kena tahu lah this kind of ni, uh, handphone ni dia punya casing dia punya part component how to manufacture it either what type of material we use is it thermoplastic is it uh, the, what type of material is it metal kalau metal how do manufacture it is it by forge is it by injection molding is it by uh, itu orang yang bidang manufacturing lah Uh, that is under mechanical also manufacturing eh, to to make this product and also we have industrial design industrial design guys dia more kepada uh, dulu kita have industrial design ni actually dia under mechanical also they are more on like artist lah. dia bukan artist dia design dia dia learn about mechanical basic tetapi they more on creativity product design like this any consumer product design a handphone design a kettle design a vacuum cleaner kan boleh dengar saya ke ada line tak okey eh? Boleh dengar, sir. Okay, industrial design. Dia more kepada, ada maybe you punya kawan-kawan, okay, you punya adik-adik ada ambil industrial. That's a good. But sekarang ni UITM number one lah, kalau industrial design. UITM, UITM dekat Sya'alam lah. Maybe 
pertolongan dan lain Even UTF, tapi sekarang ni our industry designer punya student go to KL Okay, lain putus tadi eh, sorry eh Lain putus tadi, sekarang dengar eh Plus Dengar sir. Okay, okay. Industrial design, they all learn macam you. Intro design. Macam intro design, you learn about design process. Industrial design, they learn design process. Tapi they all more thorough. They all macam sketching. Pasal you guys sketching, I ask you to buy pencil. Tapi industrial design, bila dia design produk, they all not just sketching pencil. Dia kena buy artistic punya pen. Ada marker pen, a set tu. Ha. Dia kena buat shading. Memang professional lah dia punya sketching. Kalau you tengok lah orang yang design, kalau tengok prototype ni, you tengok in internet, in uh, banyak lah, uh, pin internet konsep design yang shading yang very nice itu industrial designer ha, dia learn a lot eh industrial design ni dia design a product eh. dia 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 ni dia macam kind lah dia part dia dalam main lah dalam your team ni dia macam host lah normally industrial design ni dia host pasal dia you mechanical engineer also you part of the head eh. dia also industrial design also memang contribute really contribute pasal dia design more artistic ergonomic the shape the aesthetic look of your product your product look menawan dia dia boleh attract consumer attract buyer Kadang-kadang when you design something as engineer, we cannot think as uh, to make our product really aesthetic. We cannot think really much a relation to our product really, really function really well in the market. Industrial designer, they 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 know how they term to make your product the way the look aesthetic, eh? the punya appearance of your product, eh? macam the design, the color, the form, the shape, and eh? the size of the button. They are they are good on that. That's what we call industrial design. So we also have computer engineering. Computer engineering is ah uh, tadi electric engineering more on circuit layout semua yang design power, what type of battery power, dia punya semiconductor resistor and so on. But computer engineering more kepada software lah. Uh, sorry, computer engineering more kepada you punya hard disk apa, where is the location of your hard disk, where is the location of your motherboard. Uh, pasal semua ada device, ada motherboard, ada dia punya memory kan. Macam handphone ada hard disk memory. Uh, where is the location layout of you punya screen. Uh, you punya screen LED screen ni screen display you punya location of you punya memory you punya location of you punya battery what type of battery ah uh, itu computer engineering they design the in term of that and also we have software software in term of uh, what software do we do we choose for this phone ah uh, kadang-kadang software engineer pasal it's all a team when we design a phone macam katakan you work dengan Samsung atau you under Malaysian own kata you under one company to try to make phone our Malaysian local phone ah uh, you mesti ada this kind of team software engineer they are going to pick what type OS that we use uh, OS that we use apa kind of support ah uh, sekarang kadang kalau we use the wrong OS software engineering ni pasal uh, it will affect uh, our product eh. macam dulu cerita Nokia remember eh ni famous story lah Nokia while dia terus jadi bankrupt eh dulu Nokia dulu long time ago they are number one eh GSM eh dulu masa you guys before you guys born lagi okay, final mistake lah eh 1990s kan in 1990s uh, GSM belum ada 3G lagi semua uh, phone pakai JN yang MMS SMS memang Nokia is number one eh number one company tapi dia tak follow the technology and kemudian dia punya engineer dia dia tak follow sekarang Apple ada keluar iPhone dulu on 2008 Tapi Nokia dia tak follow, dia rentak, dia tak, dia punya dia punya team member tu make a wrong decision. They use, okay, they make a 3G, ada touch screen macam lah iPhone. Tetapi they choose the wrong OS, they choose Symbian instead of Android. Ha, macam tu. Ha, they choose the wrong OS. That's why they release banyak eh. That's why uh, dia tak go for yang this multitasking lah. Pasal Apple dah start for iPhone eh, where you have a screen, we have can ada... 3G teknologi tapi Nokia don't take that advantage itu they make a bad decision and so dia punya software engineering punya team make a wrong choice using the wrong OS not using Google Android kalau they use Google Android from the beginning memang Nokia still number one still top kind of top punya phone sekarang Nokia dah even tak dengar dah sekarang uh, the software engineer also play a role lah we have sales and marketing okay in design team also means kita mesti ada sales we must have sales eh? dalam design team in real world you mesti ada student kalau you ada group member mungkin 
macam saya mengajar semester lepas eh, sistem design also final year eh, ada participation from student from AHIP AHIP is yang student from bagian marketing right eh, in UTM eh, business management and marketing ada participation and it mean my my student is mechanical ada team member dia from sales they know about marketing ah this good kalau you punya team member know about marketing because people uh, yang good in marketing they know about consumer punya demand macam mana they know about sales and marketing to make sure that your product kalau release in the market really work Yeah, really successful. Uh, that's good because this all what that's why we call multidisciplinary eh, guys. Eh? That's why we call multidisciplinary. You tak boleh alone as a team. Tetapi you guys tak apa. You punya project ni you, you all make an tapi it's okay. That's why nanti your minor project you must be as a team. Eh? Group of five. Cannot be one person. Alright. So in design itu sekali dia ada two key. Eh? Satu design ni based on demand. Satu on technology changes. Eh? Eh? Demand when you design any product. Eh? Macam I show you. Yes. Demand is more or something demand from the market, demand from the world lah. Macam sekarang ni kita nak renewable technology, renewable energy, sorry. Renewable energy. Pasal sekarang ni kita tak nak uh, in term of environment lah, tak nak pollute the environment using apa? Carbon emission kan eh. CO2 emission by ni burning uh, kita use on technology. Right, right now lah macam like electric car semua kan, electrical car and so on. That is demand eh, uh, demand. Satu lagi based on technology changes. Guys, are you listening or not? Boleh dengar saya? Boleh. Hmm. Satu lagi, ya, satu lagi is technology change. Technology change nak macam phone lah. Dulu tak, Nokia dulu ada 3G. Dulu long time ago pakai radio control. Kemudian dia ada ni. Kemudian 3G. Sekarang ni, uh, sekarang ni dah 5G kan. Even Malaysia 5G pun belum ada lagi. I thought ada. Tak ada lagi. 5G kita belum menyeluruh lagi. Yeah, negara jiran semua dah ada 5G. Ha, kita kena up to date. Ha, itulah macam Nokia dia make a decision. Dia tak follow the technology. Dia make dia punya software engineer tak follow dekat technology changes. Sekarang dia go for different different, different OS. Ha, itu yang dia dah tercicir. Itu yang, dia, satu lagi itulah my, my point is second is based on technology changes. Macam lah 3G. 3G macam phone tu. Itu technology changes. We use the technology yang ada. The design we use of what the current technologies yang ada. Kita took the advantage to design our product. Macam sekarang ni dia nak uh, apa, IOT, right? IOT. Use the average technology of IOT. Okay. Okay, that's something. Yang demand ni macam kenderaan lah. One thing yang saya cakap eh. Macam kenderaan also example. Dulu long time ago, zaman purba, long time ago people walk. Kemudian uh, through industrial revolution dan apa ni itu tamadun eh. Uh, apa ni? Based on tamadun changes. Age eh, ni. Dan kemudian people go on uh, kereta kuda eh the horse ini, carriage ni dan kemudian uh, zaman perdagangan, trading happen, rempah, arang batu, sutra and so on people want to import, export barang to another country uh, they go for kapal to bawa also for transport pengangkutan also and then kemudian industrial revolution, uh, this demand industrial revolution, kita ada steam engine uh, industrial revolution to angkut arang batu, kayu bala and any mineral, mineral then we use train and also ada teknologi so plus teknologi ada steam engine they have train uh, we use no dan kemudian people need to be mobile world war 1 we need bicycle uh, okay uh, based on demand people need to be mobile instead of guna kereta kuda dan kemudian invent uh, ford invent kereta uh, petroleum dan kemudian uh, mobile so kita invent the car this based on demand uh, people need to be mobile now kita ada uh, aeroplane uh, even and so on and so on. Even sekarang ni kan ada flying car, flying car semua kan yang pakai like ada kipas-kipas semua lah itu so on. Itu based on demand lah. Uh, demand eh. Demand by yang ni lah. Okay. Technology changes is based on macam phone lah. For example, dulu long time ago phone kita gunakan dulu before 1980s long time ago kita don't have telecommunication like messages and so on semua. Even 3G, GSM also we don't have. We only have radio. Mobile ini macam phone ni dulu macam yang like uh, dulu orang yang only rich people can get when they go to the apa ni pedalaman eh macam toke bala eh they, they use system ato lah radio control eh dia pakai radio control by ni satellite eh satellite by only like telecom dulu eh that on the yang only rich people can can ni can communicate like very this one very bulky very big and very heavy then we have technology of GSM eh? we have ni Teknologi, we have them only, we have Adam dulu, Maxis, dulu kita ada DG, uh, ni kita ada GSM, we have mobile phone, uh, dan kemudian later on up until 2008, we have 3G, so, then Apple launch iPhone, then every uh, company want to do this yang multi touch screen, semua and so on. Uh, haptic teknologi yang touch screen, okay, before that we don't have touch screen, uh, phone we have button-button, no longer, dan kemudian uh, ini yang start the Nokia fall down, dia tak follow this trend, uh, dia tak follow the current trend and teknologi. They make a bad decision. I mean, their organization, the design team tu, dia tak peka. Okay. 
Yeah, so and so on eh. Uh, 3G and 4G later is 6G lah. Uh, this is evolution. This is based on technology changes. This is an example eh. Phone is technology changes. Okay. So, itulah design ni. When you happen before design, you kena, you have to be alert. You have to be aware of what is the current technologies eh. Technologies. Uh, technologies yang available. You can must make use of the current technologies to to adapt to your your design. So what is design? Eh? Uh, tadi I explain to design explain. Tapi one way to explain design. Eh? Design is a there are methodology. Eh? Eh? Requires a logical sequential analysis or design problem to be solved. I mean you that's why we call the design is a process. The logical sequential analysis itu adalah process. Design is process of solving problem to find apa to generate concept and find the best solution. So there there are the process you will learn. Ada logical sequential analysis. You go step by step. Ini I will explain to you later. Eh? So they set out in stages. Eh? They will you learn. You, you demand what is current trend in the market right now. Uh, you can apply. That's why you are teamwork. Kalau you are alone, you cannot. You are not, not that way. Kalau you teamwork, uh, one of you search this information. One of you search this type of information. Jadi when you gather your information, then you are strong. That's why design is a team. Eh? It's a team. Okay, that's for design to as I mentioned to you is a process of solving problem by generating alternative. Eh? Uh, that's why tadi concept, ideas. Alternative was another word of concept or ideas. Nampak S, eh? S, generating alternative, generating ideas, generating concept is the same word. Kalau boleh dengar saya, eh? uh, alternative. S, plural. Plural mean a lot. Kalau you ada five of you, at least five concepts. Then you find which one is the champion. Then all itu lah. The champion to become, bila you dah filtering all the you know, five ideas generated by each team member, you filter, filter, filter. Then maybe you combine it. Then you find the best three. Then you find the champion. Uh, that is the best solution. Uh, that is the best. Itu bau design. Eh? It's a waste. Eh? Kalau you group of five, when you give, been given a design project and you work on only one solution, uh, that is totally waste. Totally waste. You have five of you only produce one solution. That's your solution is not optimum. It's not the best. How can you become because the best color you want group only produce one? How can we say that one is the best? Best solution me, you have a lot of ideas. Then you filter, filter, filter through stages. Okay, filter, then you filter, filter, which then the champion. The champion will become the best. Uh, itu your design. Okay, it's a process of solving problem by generating ideas, alternatives, or concepts and find the best solution. That is the design. Okay. Alright, you need to skip through. Okay, this is all design process. Eh? Design process, ada banyak. Eh? You find from the internet, there's a lot of design process. Eh? Macam the phone, step one, you identify the problem. Uh, this is process you're going to be through. Tapi kita tak follow. Banyak version of process. Ini you, I find from the internet. Eh? Identify the problem. Yeah, you identify criteria, constraint. You brainstorm possible solution. Nampak solutions. Eh? Banyak solution. Solution to ideas and generate ideas. Brainstorm possible solution, then you generate ideas. Nampak tak? Ideas lot of idea then you explore possibilities select and approach ini you select the best one and you build prototype refine the design refine the design because design is always iterate you cannot just once you cannot through one cycle one cycle is not enough sometimes you will do two cycle the more cycle you've been through sometimes your final design is sometimes it's not uh, not give not do not solve it it's not the it's not the final version you sometimes there's, there will be some error you cannot be right first time then you have to refine the design then you go back again through design process the the number of cycle that you go through it the more number of cycle you go through the more the more refined you punya final solution nanti okay this is another one of design process okay yani flow dia counterclockwise eh? Recognition of need is the first. Eh? You recognize the recognition. Why do we need to design? Uh, you find the title and uh, you define the problem and you plan the project, you gather information, search information. Uh, below your information, you are enough gathering by you and your team member, then you generate ideas. You generate ideas, generate concepts. So, about that? Ask a lot of ideas and uh, then evaluate concept. Because you, okay, you have 5% of you, you generate concepts, 5 concepts, then you evaluate each concept. So which one, uh, select the most promising concept. Uh, this one champion. Then you build a prototype. Test prototype, evaluate test result. Kalau it's not right, you repeat balik. Pasal dia iterate. Sometimes in design, in industry, they bukan one cycle. They go through two cycles. Maybe dalam at six months, they go to one cycle. Maybe four months, they go to one cycle. Then they release their punya final product, their punya prototype. Eh? When they test the prototype, the prototype is not working. So they have to they go, they, they kena macam kind like rewind balik. Okay, they iterate, they iterate balik. Eh? The more stages, the more cycle you go, the more the more you learn something. The more you 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 know by mistake what you have done on your first cycle. You refine lagi you punya, you punya tu. So that's much better. Uh, so this is another sample of engineering design process. 
Right, this is another example I want to explain more. Okay, this one also another example, right? design process, lot, right? Okay, tapi in, okay, yang ini that one that I practice during, during my master eh, in UK, I'm doing my master in engineering design. Ha, ini UK, UK practice already. Ini masa 1980, uh, 1992. I doing my master 1992. Okay, market research. Dia macam ni, eh. kalau if you look yang this one, dia, dia line sikit. Eh. Dia mula-mula dia market. If you look on this one, Okay, if you look this one, mula-mula the market survey. Eh? We are as a team, eh? design can be like, I have a group of uh, four or five percent eh, in my team. My 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 colleagues eh? uh, under one group, eh? my team members. So we have to do market. You mean when we will be given a design task, design project. So we have at the first stage, we do market survey. Uh, ni market survey. We identify market. What is the market ration? What is the market trend? What is market demand? What is the consumer needs? And so on. We study the market first because we want to make sure when we design a product, we want to make sure that our product can be sell. What is we totally worthless? Eh, kalau we we don't identify the market at the beginning. Uh, so that yang ni I've been practicing is a good process. Eh, tapi kita dalam kelas kita lain sikit. Eh, tapi this is what I've been practicing. Mula-mula do market market survey as a team. Go pergi interview customer. Go market survey. Ask the company semua yang involved in industry about market about the product that we're going to design. Identify. Eh. Sometimes we have to read. Sorry, uh, lain kelas putus. Sorry, eh, saya macam ni. Putus -putus. After we do, boleh dengar sekarang? Boleh dengar. Okay. Okay, after we do market survey as a team, uh, kita gather information lah, gather information. We gather information pasal team of five kan, gather. So, orang you know, uh, interview person, pergi interview company, interview consumer, customer, semua and so on. And then kita gather information. Macam right now, you guys, kita dah ada teknologi. Dulu masa my time dulu, internet was, is not there. Internet was not born yet. Kita pakai phone, fax only. We have to go visit the company, do market survey. My, right now, you have a lot of information, everything at your fingertips. Okay? So you use, make use of technology, do market survey, so and so on. So we gather, after we do market survey, we gather all the information by um, uh, all the team member right, under one team. Uh, then we, after we gather the all information, we extract information by each team member. Extract information, what is information that we have already collected. Then we make a specification. Uh, we make a specification, it means a set of requirement before kita generate idea. Ini yang generate ideas. It means specification, product design specification ini, ini adalah information that we as a team of five gather. Each one, okay, team member A uses this information, uses information, needs uses information, different information. So then kemudian we compile our information as a team. We compile them, we sit down together and we extract all the information. We make a list of requirement. Uh, that's why it's called product design specification. And uh, you can learn about this thing in this course. You extract that information to become, to make a product design spec. Product design spec is very important. Because it represents your punya background studies. Information you and your team member has already collected. Bila this one you are strong, if your specification, your PDS is strong, then only you generate ideas. Uh, that's why they're different. People who are not taking this course and people who are taking this course like you. Kalau you are not taking this design course, kalau we give you design project, like in your high school eh, sekolah menengah bagi design project terus eh, normally people yang take not, does, not, does not take didn't take any design course bila give design project terus saja as a team maybe group of four group of five sit down round the table everything focus sketching straight away do sketching information background not enough have not done market survey have not done market survey have not apa do some apa problem dia so on eh tak ada preparation tiba-tiba you want to sketch idea no nonsense to me it's nonsense you are not prepared yet you are not well prepared to produce ideas understand that are you listening or not class yes sir Pam, yes. Eh, you are not well prepared to sketch ideas yet before when you be given the design project you are not you must be well prepared you and you team member can well prepared so what is what well, well prepared what do we mean while prepared? So, you punya information finding tu kena betul. How you define you punya, nanti kita ada step, kita stage. Macam mana you elaborate you punya information tu. Uh, then kemudian you compile information you intimate. Then kemudian you produce your specification. This is what you call specification. This is very important. Specification ni, you set a list of requirement for you to generate ideas. Make sure you generate ideas, you follow all the requirement that you set in your specification. Okay, then only cantik. Kalau specification you quad, you punya information gathering, information search, right, market service is good, then you punya product design specification is very complete, very detailed. Then you know strong. You and you team member share this specification, have the same copy. So, team member A, team member C, D, E have well prepared. It's good, can, it's better, can. You and your team member, 
each of you team member is well prepared. Each you and your team member have same amount of knowledge. Faham tak? Kalau you tak ada blur, no knowledge about what you going to design, you want to sketch idea, you cannot produce ideas, you are not well prepared. Kalau okay, that's specification defined. Bila you dah finish specification, you distribute, team leader, eh, team leader kena play a role. Distribute, make a copy of all that specification you dah written down, a set of list tu, to all team members. So, team member just read saja. So, okay, each team member ABCD are well prepared. Share the same amount of knowledge. Bau cantik. Bau cantik. Then only you can generate ideas. Ah, ini aspek orang yang tak belajar design, dia terus straight away to concept design, concept ideas, generate idea. No, totally wrong. Not well prepared. Kalau you dah prepared ni cantik, then only you can be independent. It means you and your team member can be independent. You don't depend on your another team member. You don't depend on your team leader. Pasal you have same amount of knowledge. Okay, now I can sit alone. Sit down alone. I want to produce my own idea. Team member B, sit down alone. I want to produce my own idea. Do sketching lah. Team member C, so I can produce my own idea. Because we share the same amount of knowledge before. Nampak? Where? Where is knowledge? Your PDS tu. You already read it. Because you dah discuss eh. Among, you know. Bau cantik. Each of you in the planning generate each different idea. Each his or her own idea. So, katakan you have five person of you. Bau cantik. So, you have at least five concept lah. Kemudian, you sit down together. Ah, Then, you find detail. Detail design is where you evaluate evaluation. You evaluation. You bring back. Okay, you sit down brainstorming. Okay, each one of you, okay, one person, one concept ideas. Sit down together. Compile the information. Ah, Then, you evaluate lah. Which one is the best through criteria lah. You will do criteria. This one, kita will handle later. What type? Macam mana cara? ideas, I mean, you punya ada line eh, ha, jadi you punya group have 15 concepts, 15 concept kalau you evaluate terus saja, ok, 15 concept, you evaluate, ok, you select the best 10, yang 5 tu, buang lah ok, 10, generate balik select the best 5 ok, then the final concept, final punya, final punya stage from the 5, the best 3, the best 3, then the final champion, kalau you buat ada, itu lagi cantik, so you punya final design tu, bertambah-tambah cantik, the more optimum solution uh, that will become your detail design. After detail design, then kita fabricate, manufacture, then kita, then kita sell. Uh, nampak tak? Ada sell. Kita manufacture ni, you fabricate lah. You will do physical prototyping. Eh. Kalau kita face to face, maybe kita physical prototyping. Kalau tak pun kita online, kita buat uh, virtual. Okay, then only kita sell. Sell, I mean, uh, ni yang uh, sell. Kadang-kadang, you punya produk berjaya. Your product is successful in term, until fabricating is good. You test you your prototype working. Memang working you punya machine or any device that you design. It works. Tetapi, when you want to go for sell, it's not working. Tak laku. You punya cannot cannot sell. Does not make it in the market. What, what happened? Apa problem dia? You punya product, you design process dah cantik. Everything, you buat market survey, everything is nice, so beautiful. But when you want to sell your product, because when you design something, you want to sell your product to the market, in the market, right? Yeah? You want to make profit. Your organization, your company have to make profit. But cannot be sell. That must be something wrong. That's why in your design team, that's why design team ni, can remember kan, design team ni, when you involve at ni, they involve multidisciplinary. It's good. You have to lah cakap, kalau you ada student from AHIP, they know about marketing. Ha, itu yang. Dengar saya ya, Clive? Okay ya? Boleh, boleh faham apa saya kan? Yes, yes. Ha, kalau you final year, sistem design nanti ada. Sekarang tak ada. Nanti you akan final year, akan jumpa saya balik eh, ha, kelas sistem design. You punya final year, first semester, sistem design. Ya, itu you akan involve dengan student marketing. Student from AHIP, also from final year, akan join you punya team. Ha, itu cantik. You punya design, ada team member, they know about marketing. Tapi kita too bad lah. Kalau you know sell. Tapi saya involve when I do master, ada. We do marketing. Kita learn about marketing juga sekian. Okay, ini design yang saya practice eh. Tapi in our class, it's like this. Boleh faham eh? Kelas okay eh? Sekarang kelas. Yes. Nampak selak? Okay, this is what we practice eh. It's the same eh. Kalau kita extract macam ni. Mula-mula is recognition of need. Okay, kita you 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 cari you punya title. Why sir? Recognition. Mengenali keperluan. Recognition. You need. Why Why you want? You propose me sir. We want to do this project. It means you recognize. It's the same like you do market survey. Market survey ni you identify market. What is the, you tengok karakter. Apa yang people need? What product you want to solve? Then you find the title. Itulah kadang-kadang if you design something tapi the market is not there. It's totally worthless lah. 
useless juga eh no point you design that one ah recognition of need why you need to design this thing apa ada demand tak in the itu important this kind like market survey okay bila you already you have your title then you kemudian you define you punya problem ni i will explain later lah eh kita define kita punya problem define kita punya problem you have your title already then you define your problem why define problem definition mean you elaborate more eh? you define eh? you make a design brief eh? so you because you make a clear problem statement because you and your team member have to be at the initial have a clear problem statement kalau your problem statement is not clear you don't know the direction kalau you make under problem definition test you can you can see a clear path a clear direction where a search to find information you can see a clear path a clear direction uh, by problem definition that is a method that you do my mapping objective three and so on into later on the next lecture lah okay that problem after you clear then only you find direction for you to search information lah search information then i'll explain to you what a source of information in design okay you can search search information you and your team members search different area of information then you sit down together compile all your information compile your information uh, then you extract your information to become a product design spec product specification in here we have eh, my master ni ada specification in here tak ada tapi it's between the pds is between the PDS, your product is application. Below PDS is right, okay, your PDS is your checklist, a set of requirements. So, you mean you share your PDS among your team member so that only you have the same amount of knowledge, okay? You are well prepared. You and your team member well prepared. Then only you go for conceptual design. Uh, then you will generate ideas, uh, brainstorming. Uh, this one, you produce a lot of sketching at this stage, conceptual design. You will do a lot of sketching. Eh? Each one of you do sketching, sketching, sketching. Tapi, before you do sketching ideas, you must be well prepared. Ni, ini you must go through ni. Up ni the output from per ni is your PDS. It's not nanti later I explain to you. Ada sini ya eh, PDS before concept design. Bila PDS is good and ready, each one of you have the same copy. Each one of you like kind of memorize only or what is listed on the PDS. Each one of you have the same copy. You refer to your PDS. Make sure okay. This PDS represent your knowledge, you and your team member. Okay, kalau your PDS is so shallow, so brief, so brief, it means so shallow your background studies. Uh, so PDS have to be detailed. Below PDS is good, then only then only you generate ideas. Eh? You generate ideas, concept to design. So each one of you kata paling minimum pun one idea lah. Jadi you have five of you, five ideas. Then after you concept idea, then you brainstorm evaluation of your concept. Eh? You evaluate which one is the best. Then you get your final design. So you have your detailed design. Eh? Detail design is your final design. Then you more refine your final design. Detail lah. This is what we call initial embodiment design. We detail design, we put select material. We refine lagi like put the detail dimension, detail sketching of our component and the one that you design. Then after that, you are certified. Uh, you do some maybe some little bit uh, analysis, little bit. Eh? Then only you go for manufacture lah. Before manufacture, you will do solid work modeling. Eh? You do you do engineering drawing, solid work modeling, and then only you go for manufacture. Manufacture can be can be virtual or can be physical. Kalau virtual, you do some simulation lah, to make sure that your mechanism works or not. Uh, until that's what the last one is your final product lah. Eh? Your final product is your virtual prototype. It can be physical prototype. Eh? So, kalau you tengok, the arrow can go up and go down. Go up and down. So, it means it's iteration. It's iteration. Because it's iteration. Sometimes we are in concept design. is something, even if we are in detail design. We find out our detail design is something not right. Because maybe the PDS that we produce is wrong. We miss, we miss, apa, miss information. We have a wrong, uh, 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 apa, there is something statement in the PDS that is wrongly stated. Uh, we have to betulkan, maybe about standard, maybe about the size. Uh, so, kita kena reverse balik. Then, we will generate balik a new idea. We mean the generate concept, generate which number is totally wrong because wrong at the beginning. Wrong information from the PDS. So, generate concept by each member is wrong. So, sometimes we have to iterate. Kadang-kadang uh, design ni kadang-kadang ada signal. Signal tu datang lambat. Kadang-kadang uh, tiba-tiba the trend cakap, okay, based on ni, you cannot use this material. Uh, your PDS, you have to change something. It means the idea generation have to be reversed. Uh, you have like that, eh? the iteration. So, this is the design process. Eh? Ini you kena memorize lah, design process that you kena been through lah, through this semester, eh? design process. Okay, so, okay, problem initially, you kena prepare design brief and problem statement. Nanti I explain later lah. Eh? Today, kita punya first meeting, I don't want to explain more. Uh, Okay. Alright, faham tak? Before I don't want to go terlalu detail pasal kita dah second week eh. Faham kelas? Ada question? Hello. Yes. So there's an yeah, international student in this class. So maybe sir can try to use more English because some of them uh, did, yeah. did not understand during the class. Alright, okay. Can you make... but, 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 but basically, do you understand what I'm talking about? Eh? 
the rest of you do you understand what i'm talking about generally respond please yes i understand sir understand okay maybe yeah, i mix certain with uh, malay language okay moment i try to make a one percent english okay all right so this basically i already explained to you about the design process and eh, the importance of design process eh? so you will work as a team eh? you cannot work alone eh? as a team eh? so kita multidisciplinary okay I just want to make it short because I said you have minor project dulu. Eh? You have minor project. Eh? Uh, I want to. You must take. You, know, you must be aware of this uh, design process. Ni, kena be aware of this. You, you, this one, this design process. You have, kena. You will do it. Eh? You will face through this design process. Eh? You will be using this design process through your the whole semester for your major project. Okay, the title of my project I uh, still not open. Uh, I still not give to you lagi. So I, the first thing I, what I want to discuss is about your minor project. Later I will give you the title of major project. Maybe on the second meeting tomorrow. Okay, uh, it's a minor project. Minor project ni, okay, I share you. Boleh nampak? The, can you see my e-learning? Yes. Okay, e-learning ni under minor project. Can you see ni? Minor project, you click on here. Okay, let me open. Right. Okay, let me share it. Let me stop sharing dulu. Share. Boleh nampak ni? Can you see this one? Minor project? Yes, sir. Boleh nampak eh? Can you see eh? That minor project. So, this is a minor project. So, okay. You boleh tak? You guys form a group of four or five. We cannot be three, six tak boleh. Six too much, three to 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 ni lah. Too few for your group. Four or five eh? Group of four or five. You form a group. Okay. Make sure kalau let's say you are group of five. Each one you must uh, appoint one as a group leader. Mesti ada group leader. Cannot group leader cannot do lah. You is minor project. Boleh dengar saya? Can you hear me, guys? Yes. Yeah. Boleh, sir. Okay. The title is Mechanical Video Device. Make sure a team leader, eh, appoint one as a team leader. Team leader, make sure that each team member different title. One, you appoint them Mechanical Feeder. Okay. The other one, Mechanical Flipper. The other one is Medical Object Placing System. This is not major project, guys. This is minor project. Eh? Minor project. And one is mechanical timing device. Another one is mechanical trigger mechanism. And the one is motion transfer device. I think that's all. How many we have? How many title we have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we have motion transfer. We have trigger mechanism. We have timing. And we have object placing. And we have flipper and we have feeder. Okay, to explain to you, eh? okay, I explain to you from the bottom first. Eh? Okay, mechanical, okay, this project, eh, all of this minor project, they have only the, the different, only the title yeah? and the format, everything is the same. So, this project, you only have to produce, you do some research on what existing product that you can easily assess, you can get through based on your title. You do some sketching. Eh? What you do, you will do kind of, we call it. Uh, Dissectioning. It's much prefer you can get that physical product. Eh? Any toys that you can easily assess, you can buy, you can get it. Uh, then you dismantle that product, and when you dismantle that component, you study about what the mechanism. That's why how do you 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 collect information. That's how you 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 generate knowledge about your punya project title. For example, like motion transfer device. Motion transfer device, any anything, eh, any device that you can easily get, yang yang involve motion transfer. Motion transfer is something that you study about mechanism. You dismantle, eh, dissectioning. Dissectioning means uh, what is meaning of dissection? If you look on my live video, eh, dissectioning means dissection. Dissectioning. The word is dissection. Dissection is good, eh, in design. Eh, kalau you do dissectioning, it means you study on existing product. Dissectioning means you bedah siasat lah ini Malay eh? bedah siasat dissectioning it mean you get the product you cannot be virtual you have 
preferably i encourage to you prefer you get actual product uh, actual product uh, dissectioning dissectioning mean you study the product what is the mechanism tapi your product that you get must 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 follow must obey the your title lah the motion transfer device motion transfer device is anything mechanism involved with motion transfer involve in motion transfer it means something like uh, mechanism they have motion transfer from translation moving forward downward and maybe they have rotary motion and how this rotary motion can transfer to this forward and backward for example like like door knob eh? like door handle like door handle you want to study remember macam door handle can you see my drawing class my live video can you see my drawing hello class boleh share yes. door handle this one motion ni is rotary motion kan Automation. Then you have you punya compartment of you punya locker here, and why you punya latch to, how you punya latch to. Bila you turn door, what what is the mechanism ni? And the latch to go forward and ah uh, this one in translation. Yeah, this is translation. Translation movement is forward, backward, horizontal, or vertical. Yang ini rotary. Ah, uh, this is motion. This example is motion transport device. I mean you you okay. For example, you want to do this door handle. You you much preferably. I encourage you. You get the disorder. Uh, I think they have a lot of component. Maybe you can reduce down, make a simpler version. Uh, basically, you understand what is the mechanism, lah. Mechanism. It, it is uh, this motion transfer. Motion transfer can be any, not not just door handle. Any any device that you study the motion and how when you do cause other react. When much I turn this this door handle, the, it will come. The latch will go inside. If I turn this way, it will go back to its initial position. A lot of things. Macam kipas angin. Macam uh, kipas angin also. Kipas angin uh, table fan, like table fan. Why? Why is table fan when, when you, okay. Yeah, okay. Table fan. Table fan, you press the button. Uh, okay, yeah. Table fan, the button. Eh? Do you have two button? When you press stop, stop. And when you press this, uh, this, this not. Yeah, this one is trigger mechanism. This one is under trigger mechanism. Where is trigger mechanism? Ah, ni. Number two is trigger mechanism. Class, are you watching lah? Hello, class. Yes, yes, yes. Trigger mechanism. Tadi motion transfer is the most general. Paling easy, banyak lah. Yang saya contoh, banyak lah. Anything yang gearing, movement. Uh, that one is uh, motion transfer. Okay. You can produce sketching on this. Eh? You can produce uh, three sketches on this. Boleh dengar lain betul saya. Can you hear me guys? Sorry ya, ada lain breakdown. Class, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, mo trigger mechanism is, okay, measure team leader. One of your team member, one one already done motion transfer, one is trigger. Trigger mechanism like uh, table fan. Not just table fan, stand fan also. Table fan kan, you have, you punya ni. And you have this front tool. I give you only one example. At least a lot of things. Your creativity guys, eh? your creativity. Okay, maybe you discuss with your group member. Can you have button kan? Speed one lah. Uh, this is trigger. Why Why do we, pasal we just know how to use this table fan. When we press the zero button, okay, do we have two speed? Speed one, speed two. We press this, when we press this one, speed one. When we press this stop button, this one raise up. Understand guys? Hello class. Yes. Uh, this is triggering. This is what we call triggering. What, what we need to study, what the mechanism, you don't have to sketch the whole table fan, no need. Only focus on that area saja. Understand that? Yes. Faham kan? Ah, dia triggering. You press it and it goes up. And when you press stop, ni, why why dia macam tu? That is triggering. Understand? Yes, sir. Dia triggering. Macam mechanical pencil, you trigger pop, you dah ada. Simple. Tapi saya dah boring lah. Eh. Saya dah, I'm, sorry, I, frankly, I'm bored with uh, mechanical pencil. Too much from the blue student cloud if go for trigger mechanism, mechanical pencil. They trigger the lash and go for something else lah. something new okay macam for example like this okay even at the table fan table fan ni at the table fan this is your blade kan ini you punya at the back compartment and you have this can you have this what we call it this kind like a button here right guys button this is your table fan when you press it it will swing kan yes it will swing. when you press it will not swing ini apa motion transfer or trigger 
Trigger. No motion transfer kan? Is it motor sensor apa? Why? Uh, yeah, you you are right. Uh, trigger or motor sensor? Maybe saya, I'm wrong. Motion transfer trigger. Bila you press, it will swing. When you pull it up, it will not swing. Uh, is it under lights under motion transfer or trigger? Plus. Trigger. <laughs> trigger, ah, yeah. Trigger, trigger lah. It's up your decision, eh. Trigger. You can study. Only study this mechanism. Do sketching. Faham tak? Sketching, you design, you study. But that's mean of decisioning. Tu lah. I encourage to guy to open. You ada kipas kan? Dekat bilik kan? Buka lah. You have to open. This method like study on the new. Tapi janganlah rosakkan kopak-kopak tu -kopak, no lah. You as engineer, you know how to dismantle the mental your product, right? Tu lah kan, class. Study yang ni, trigger, ini motion transfer. Tadi saya cakap, uh, itu lah dia, door knob. Okay, that's trigger mechanism. Okay, next title apa? Timing. Ah, timing. Timing apa? Timing device. Anything remove dengan timing. Apa dia? What is the example? Timing device. Timer. Student normally call a timer, they go, sir, alarm clock. Like, I bought a reading with that. Alarm clock, uh, thermostat, oven, timer, tick, 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 tick. Can you, can like creativity go something as about anything involved with timing? Any mechanism, you read eh, tengok baca eh, finding. Uh, what is the meaning of timer eh, timing. Mechanical timing, apa lagi timing? Beside alarm clock, yeah, so normally student alarm clock, the way, alarm clock dalam ni is very complicated guy. Memang yeah, memang student always go for alarm clock, uh, thermostat controller on your opinion. Timer, then only the ring. Apa lagi? Timing is something like it control the motion um, at the back of kipas. I mean, can it go for timing? What is it? The purpose of this? To swing back and forth. Is it, this one is swinging motion. This is trigger, can it? Is it trigger or? Uh, Is it involved with time? Is it involved with timing tak? The swing, the the swing rotation of the swing. I mean, not the rotation of your blade. The the rotation of your swing, it remain constant rotation right? when, when, uh, is it involved dengan timing? Uh, yes. Now, if you think yes, you can go that for timing. Uh, tapi kalau somebody dah choose this, you punya team member, uh, another team member cannot do the same lah. You go, okay, you claim this one for, I mean, because, Why yeah, I said this is timing also? Uh, yeah, this is fall into timing is more accurate rather than trigger. Trigger is yang button, yeah. This one button is trigger. Time, this motion transfer also can. Motion transfer is more easy. Can go for anywhere as long as the motion transfer. Tapi this one more accurate on timing. Why? Because who, what drive the swing? Can you see the the swing of you punya blade of your fan to at constant speed? I mean the rotation, not the blade. Eh? The blade is very high speed. The swing and. Eh? At this constant rotational speed, slow again, and go that direction, left and right, left and right. What drive that swing? What is okay? Line put us, eh? Class, can, are you listening or not? The motor, class. Can you hear me? Yes, sir. Yes. Back, your motor, the source of power is your motor. The motor that drive the blade very high PM. Tapi from the you, your source of motor rotation is your motor. How does the high power of the motor drive the timing of the swing of your, not your fan blade, the swing of your compartment, your fan blade, this direction very slow motion at constant speed. That is timing also. Understand that, class? That is timing, class. Itu boleh consider, that we can consider that as timing device. Not, normally student, timing, alarm clock. Timing is a tick, 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 ring. Ah, that, how the mechanism. Okay lah, too, too much on that lah. Try to something else, creativity. Timing. What is timing? How do you define timing? And you know, that, this can consider defined as timing. Understand, class? You control yeah. from high rotation, high speed. Your input power is high movement, high power or speed. Uh, I mean, high speed. But the, the, your output of your system, they remain slow motion. Uh, that is considered as timing. They remain the same speed, either rotation movement or maybe translation movement. Uh, that is your creativity. That is considered as timing. Plus, understand that? Any device, any can you can do. Boleh eh? Can? Can do or not? 
बोले क्लियर होना क्लास राइट ओके द नेक्स्ट टाइटल इज मैकेनिकल ऑब्जेक्ट प्लेसिंग सिस्टम ओके व्हाई डू यू नो बाय मैकेनिकल ऑब्जेक्ट प्लेसिंग सिस्टम एनी मैकेनिकल एनी मैकेनिज्म दैट दे प्लेस ऑब्जेक्ट फ्रॉम वन पॉइंट टू वन पॉइंट maybe they pick something they drop it here not just picking normally student they go for toys lah like a crane uh, they pick a gear pole and then they release a crane that one is too general lah eh something different you, your creativity make it more interesting mechanical object placing system a uh, robot arm nah yeah robot arm too common <laughs> robot arm nah i'm talking about robot arm robot arm not necessary robot arm Boleh, if you want to do robot arm pun boleh yang toys man. I mean, can I encourage, ni kind like compulsory lah. I can see like most to compulsory. Because the word is dissection guys. Dissection, major project, eh, sorry, minor project, dissectioning. Dissectioning ni, what you mean by dissection? Dissection ni, you, you, berdasiasiat, what you call it in English? You, you have to get the actual product lah. You got to the, get the actual product. You have to do dissection. You have to dismantle. You study the part. How this mechanical component connect? How the how the mechanism work? Why is this thing what we call? You claim it to be uh, the this uh, timing device. Um, for example, like this object placing system. Uh, that's it. You, you can get actual product. Okay. Apa yang you cakap tadi? Robot arm. Yeah, robot arm one of it lah. Tetapi dah general lah sangat lah. Uh, robot arm. Yes. Apa lagi? Your question. Mechanical object placing system. Apa lagi? Any device, something that the place object one point to in one point. You place an object at one point and place two to different point. Need not just picking, guys. Eh? Placing does not mean picking. Robot on it pick, grab and pick. That is one point. Out, ah yes, conveyor belt can do. It bring one at one point to another point. We mean much like material handling. It's kind like material handling. Material handling means you bring any benda anything, not just conveyor belt. Anything can do. At one point to different point, you can maybe you can get from simple mechanism any device that anything that you can get around you. Macam door knob can lah door knob door knob is motion transfer, door knob motion transfer. Macam uh, you go for uh, system blinder of tingkap tu blinder you pull the string and the blind the lipat the folded and unfolded. That one is more like motion transfer. That is not timing and that is not object placing. It's more like your creativity. I don't know. Uh, you this you you try to do this your creativity understand object placing macam tadi cakap robot arm is common lah robot arm pick that one it pick doesn't mean pick and drop doesn't mean placing mean you bring at one point not your device your device the mechanism of device bring something at one point to another point that is placing understand maybe at level A to level bawah level from up top level to bottom maybe at this point B at this level here Remember, student can go. Well, normally, student, if you want go to for escalator in the mall, yeah, escalator system. There's too much, lah, because I, I, that is too complex, lah. It, it can, you want to study, boleh. You have to go for internet, ni. Because I, I cakap preferably, I encourage you, kind like compulsory to you get any simple device, yeah. You can open that product and you know about stuff. Kalau that's much better. You study when you get the physical product. You study, then you think of the mechanism, uh, then you study about it. Uh, macam dulu, long time ago, eh, long time ago dulu, my student, eh, stu uh, apa ni, student perempuan lagi, eh, girl student, eh, uh, okay, dengar saya, eh. Okay, her title is timing device. Nanti she don't know, I, I, I ask her to get actual product. So she, then she go for, when she go for music box. You know what is music box? Pra, you listen or not? Music box. Yes. Music box, can you can buy from the mall. Can you can buy for 10 ringgit. You can get music box or maybe 12 ringgit. Eh? Music box, can you have, when you when you turn the knob and they have something inside. And then kemudian they, they have uh, maintain the constant speed, kan? Uh, but to because when you turn the knob you have something like a coil spring I okay we can just see we don't know what's inside uh, that's why when this i asked her to buy she bought it she bought it and kemudian i also bring it to the class then she dismantle in at, at college she open you bring it to class dismantle, and we study we study then if she become interested and in then she study a lot we have a coil spring 
they have a they have a kind like a comb punya metal plate to make the music note she study about and they have the gearing they have the counter gear she learns a lot from there that's advantage of minor project when you buy actual product you study you study about it then then she learn a lot of things then she become interested on this music box then she propose a new idea to design it's a brilliant ideas uh, for example this music box okay sir she studied then she become mastermind she, sorry not mastermind she become master in this music box marketing because she study she understand what music how the behave mechanism because she bought it she this matter she study about the mechanism before that we just use music box turn the knob and play song from there after she learned from this and kemudian she came up with brilliant idea sir i want to design something is much better than this why not music box we can play different song because music box kan the music box kan remember music box kan you have this if you open music box you have a drum drum is a cylindrical shape and you have a pin 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 this pin this pin this yang play your music normally music box they play classic music only kan classic music eh classic music only the pin the pin that 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 apa press the music note the clack the core metal shape she she give a new she have idea that's a that's an advantage when you do that session it give you a new idea innovation that is design creativity so i want to design is much better than this in the future lah dia cakap she want to design something that more flexible we can print different song ah so use your creativity yeah because normally common even right now music box is still from long time ago up until here, there is no innovation just remain like that no innovation why not we make i'm not talking about m3 maybe there is some young annoying sounds eh why do you want to design music what we have mp3 play we now we are for no nonsense don't bother about it we are go for acoustic we go because sometimes that is a market some people like japan japan eh? japan buyers japan lot of eh? people then they want unique product and eh? there is a store that sell this unique product normally when i go to music box in shop eh? banyak lot in kl still common still the same music box is still the same you the also if you want to play different song you have to buy different music box. why not you just plug it different song plug it we have our main music box plug it play different song ah this idea come from her not me understand guys are you listening or not yes ah that's the point she she decide uh, her, her title on the timing device i have said she don't have any idea what title so then we discuss then at the end we make some result we go for timing on nice way we can easily get music box why don't you buy music box you can like timing eh? so she, she study about it Why, why we call it timing because the knob and maybe the turn of the knob and the gearing and set and remain the constant speed you can consider timing also motion transfer also can tapi she more on time but she study something on it so she try to make it better so why not we plug flexible music board kalau dia buat she ha, dia pattern dia pilih she can make money on that so there is a bias eh? ada demand on the people we want to play different song this plug the drum maybe the drum too different The music note of the young comb shape music note metal plate is the same they have a b c d e f g right and maybe are the minor are the b flat i don't know eh so tapi only the drum the drum they have they have tone they have oh, what you call spine here again then they have they have a small small pin here that that play the music so you want to play different song only by the drum then you plug on that one so it's only different different changes only can make a lot of things uh, the example about Yeah, advantage eh, about minor project when you, when you get actual product you study, it can give you some new ideas. Alright, mechanical. Okay, mechanical object placing system tadi pa mega ya. Get a new idea, not not just a uh, robot arm, anything that any device that that bring you transfer an object from at one point to different point. Okay, pa. Class. Yes. Alright, the next title is a uh, mechanical flipper device. Mechanical flipper device anything object that will do flipping any object any mechan mechanism that will do flipping flipping means something will flipping your object it go decide this one goes up this one Class, are you okay? Line tadi okay. Uh, okay, sambung ni. Eh? Mechanical flipper device. Any idea mechanical flipper device? Example is what? It will flip. It will flip. Device two, it may be it will flip your page. Any device that will turn your page. Any device that will when you press something, it goes like this. Any device when maybe you have handle, you 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 press the handle, the device will 
go for 180 degree flipping mean 180 degree yes right 180 degree turn that's what defined by flip right Kla, are you listening or not yes any device banyak a lot of thing eh? macam a lot of gadget toys or simple simple device when you press handle it will flip flip not macam melak kipas angin tadi no kipas angin the the, the like the table fan they want the swing swing they want is more on motion transfer and also timing eh? from the high speed of the motor why the constant speed why from the high speed of the motor why you maintain the constant speed of the 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 apa, compartment of the fan that one is more on timing and also motion transfer can do that's why it's not flipping because the angle to not flipping flipping to at any angle your punya angle is turn 180 degree any mechanism below when you touch anything at the cost it will turn 180 degree when you release it when you release the uh, the trigger you release the or handle or knob or button that it go back to or is original position reverse back 180 degree when you when you do something it flip 180 degree and you release it, you go back to initial position. Understand that, class? That is flipping. Plus? Clear? Yes. That, that's flipping. Okay. The next title is feeder. Okay, this is the last one. Feeder is feeder. Feeder is anything that do feeding. Apa masuk feeder? What do you mean by feeder? Feeder tu masuk apa? Get food. Feeder, they feed something. They feed something. Feeder ni that's not I mean feeding give food to animal. No, no, it doesn't mean feeding. Eh? Uh, feeder ni something like you you put. Like for example, you have a you have a feeder lah. You have something here. You put a lot, mount, lot of thing here. You make a lot of things. You put uh, marbles, for example. Maybe food. Eh? Maybe food. Uh, cat food. Eh? Granular or something. Eh? You pour it in feeder to, tapi to make sure that it flow out constantly one by one. Sometimes it or you get stuck. The problem it got stuck. It got stuck always at the neck. In, in this an example, not not uh, this not only one. This example. So that is a device. How they control that? Uh, the device here, mechanical feeder. That how how that they can flow out. This thing go constantly one by one. Something like that. This is one example. For example, like uh, coin, uh, coin um, feeder, feeder, banyak, banyak a lot of things. Feeder means any device, they have kind like a feeder, they have a compartment, they have a hopper or any tank and you pour in or mount large amount of something, maybe coins, maybe marble and they do the output it, uh, maybe candy and they do at the knob, at the nozzle, at the bottom. Uh, when you open it, when you turn the nozzle on the nozzle, it will do distribute one by one, and it will not get stuck. Uh, that example of video. Water dispenser count as video. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Other student, yeah. Some one well, dulu student they go for water dispenser as video. Um, boleh, can, can also. Tetapi water dispenser ni is more on liquid lah. Tapi nanti your because I want your minor project to relate with your major. Your major project nanti I will give you title. It does not involve with liquid. And you understand me tak? The one that you asked tadi just now. Yes sir. Siapa nama, siapa nama awak tadi? Siapa awak? Uh, Lim Pang Jun. Uh, Pang Jun. Eh? Kalau you water, you go for water, you and your team member. Eh? You buat... Uh, Feeder, you go for water dispenser. Oh yeah, good lah. It's good for minor project. You satisfied already fulfill the title lah. Uh, tetapi nanti your major project does not involve with liquid. Nanti I give you the title. Nanti you punya preparation ni kind like tak relevant lah. Kind not relevant if your major project. Go for physical. Okay. Yeah. Uh, nanti ada nanti I give you title. Yeah, because banyak student eh, they go for long time ago. I get their title uh, motion transfer. You know they choose palm tandas. You punya toilet bowl, the system, the the pump system. But the the major project title is mechanical sorting device. Not, that's not relevant. The system of you punya toilet bowl system, the flush system. Eh? They go for flush system for motion transfer for.
Okay, line putus tadi. Itulah, make sure that you punya minor project tu really contribute to your major project. Kau berapa sekarang? Keras. Uh, 3.45. Oh. Kita sampai pukul 5 tau. Okay, I give you 10 minute break. Okay, this is a title, eh? Mechanical Video Revise. Okay, I want, I want you, I go you for 15 minute breaks. Lepas tu kita come back again. Boleh kelas? Hello? Okay, so do we have any attendance? At the end of the class. Okay, sir. Apa tu, pasal kita dah miss one week. Sorry guys, eh? One week, saya last week ada, ada, ada ni. Certain things that ni. Uh, boleh tak? Okay, memang kita tulis 3 hours kan? Kita 15 minute break. During 15 minute, I want you to form a group. Boleh tak? Then you come back to me after 15 minute, the week ini. Kita sambung balik. We join, then you already have a group. Boleh? Can you do that for 15 minutes? Okay. Boleh. Okay, kita 15 minute break. Okay, you distribute all the money lah. Nanti you... Okay, alright. Okay, kalau kita break for 15, eh? 15 minutes. Hello kelas. Assalamualaikum. Are you there? Boleh dengar saya ke? Bila tu? Boleh dengar eh? Right. Okay. Um, right. So you already formed the group kan? Only group 8 saja yang saya I have not seen yet. Group 8 eh? Group 8. So we have 39 students. Suppose uh, group 8 is 4 students. Eh? Group 8. Okay. So who are group 8 still not there that so make sure you group 8 you have four eh four persons for your group 8 okay class you already got your own group so group leader you must appoint one as your group leader lah gonna appoint one as a group leader so make sure that uh, okay uh, seven group have five student eh make sure you can select any five titles and eh? we have each team member have different title Okay, different title. Okay, the format uh, I will not explain to you. You have to do get the get the title first. Make sure okay you each team member different title. So okay, after you get your own title, then you can um, apa to use your creativity to get what is the uh, product that you are going to do research on for your minor project. Understand? Okay, you. Preferably, I say I encourage you guys to get actual product physically, then you can do this mental, you do dissectioning, I mean you open all the parts, component, then, then you study this component, so that is much better. So you study and you do some sketching on the how the mechanism is. Okay, just to tell you guys, and because I am afraid, I don't want your research title on your minor project that you choose, it's not relevant to your to your major project title. Okay, I want to show you major project title. Uh, I only have the team only. I don't have uh, any specific title. Maybe I decide for you and you group member, you decide on your own. Eh? So group leader, you set a meeting with your group member to set a meeting what title you are going to do your group for your major project. Eh? I'm not talking about minor. Minor project, you have been given a title. What? Okay, what title? For, you have been given the topic. Eh? It's, it's title. Lah. I mean, title. So what product to you, you, you decide? You, each individual have to decide. So to make sure that I want your research on your minor project, I mean, does really contribute to the major project. That's the most important. I don't want it because mungkin some of you do, like for example, flushing for motion transfer device use uh, toilet flushing system. It's not relevant. It's not relevant. Yang tadi cakap, tadi siapa tadi yang cakap about yang water dispenser. It's not relevant to the major project. Go for, if you want to go for feeder device, go for something different. So, how will it contribute to major project? Okay, your major project, I share you. The, we already, the meeting is like this. We discussed it like this. If you, can you see my uh, class? Can you see this document? Eh? This is our meeting, eh? my lecturer. Previously, we have set. So, for section 8, can you see this one, guys, class? Hello, class. Are you there? 
Ah, ah, kau senyap, saya ingat lain putus kan penat saya bercakap eh? Okay, can you see this one? Major project ya? Yes Session 11, we are session 11 right? Yes Session 11, any topic title Okay, I think I want you to do I don't want to give you title Maybe I will you, your group leader Have to discuss with your own group any topic we are under this team any industry innovation and infrastructure the other one go for zero hunger zero hunger mean the topic the team is zero hunger is about more any product any system they design for to reduce hunger lah, to zero hunger and another one for good health and well-being it's more like uh, rehabilitation upper rehabilitation something that has a device that that could help people at the hospital something like that eh, any device Clean water and sanitation is more on uh, clean water lah for uh, clean water and sanitation punya system. Uh, kita go for most yang general. I think this one uh, innovation. Eh? Can you see the innovation? The way is innovation. Anything that involved with innovation. You know what is meaning of innovation? Innovate lah, innovation lah. Something new, right? Innovation. Something innovation. Something so it means the title can be anything. Eh? You design a product or device. That could be. I'm talking about your your major project. That could have innovation. Eh? Something that you solve human problem. Because design is something our project. We try to solve human problem. A lot of thing. Eh? Something about innovation. Innovation is something that that we could do. Innovation. What is the bit, bit, bit different between innovation and invention? Invention is we create something new, right? It's invention. Sorry, line putus lagi ya. Dengar saya, eh, kelas. Can you hear me? Hello, kelas. Yes, sir. Okay, innovation is something about innovate. Innovation. Any maybe you can look on current product, existing product, something that you do for to make it better, innovate. Eh? You can solve human problem. So, what is human problem? Everything, anything, all aware, all around you, be aware. Something that maybe your everyday life, your activity, you can do something that that could solve your make it better solve your everyday life maybe not not just engineering in industry maybe your everyday life something that uh, macam dulu uh, last year i give student is that's falls under category innovation uh, the major project is about hands free device the team was anything you design hands free device hands free device. because uh, at last year covid 19 is at the peak right so I will ask the student to do anything in hands free. One of my purpose, my idea, my main idea is so that the student design something like hands free. For example, like you enter a premise eh, shop, eh, you open the door. You we, we want to avoid to touch the door handle. So it means a device at any door, any premises. We just press the foot on the pedal and the door will open itself. Then we can sanitize our hands. Sometimes we 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 have. Every shop they have this sanitizer, right? Eh? Or you bring your own, you wash your hand. But you when you you open the door, you touch your hand at the doorknob, at the premises, even at ATM machine room in uh, at the bank. Uh, so you your device is any you design uh, like a foot pedal, uh, foot pedal. You press and the door will open and close. Uh, so uh, there is something like it all and the, the one is under the team is hands free device. Last year I gave hands free device. I I'm not sure whether I want to give the same hands free device. Maybe your project can be anything on hands-free device. That is also about innovation. Okay, one of the group, because the team is uh, hands-free device, not your liquid, your, this one, eh, this body wash liquid, eh, will be totally pour in, not accurately, and eh, not uniformly, or uh, not optimally pour into this bottle. Maybe you have some inter, some device that could easily do this task for you, kind of like automatic, uh, something like that. This example, I am not sure this one is a good one. It's, this is something like solve human problem everyday life. Maybe you, you just pour your, your refill. Maybe you propose something, something system, uh, something like that you can reduce and totally and accurately you don't waste. Sometimes we when we press press this one into it's kind of like tedious. This the nozzle is so small, okay? The lid here, the nozzle here yeah, yeah. opening is so small and what to pour it. Maybe okay. Some of you have said the simple idea we use just a cone shape. So maybe it's this kind of like automatic device. It's up to you. What is your creativity is something like uh, can solve you more. This is something that I didn't say you. This is example, example, solve you more. Lot, this one thing. Uh, 
uh, maybe I, I, I face problem, we face problem in, in the bathroom. If you have the device, something we have some interface here and you just pour it and easily, you can easily blow 100%, everything will be drained out from this refill into this one. So, and we can buy another refill again. If you pour it manually by hand, it's kind of like problem, uh, it's something like that. This is an example. Eh? Boleh kan, Pak Ameh? Okay, class. Okay, your minor, so you discuss lah, so you focus dulu on your minor project and then uh, itulah saya cakap you punya, apa tu, your, uh, this thing lah, uh, ni, kita under industry innovation, this our project fall into this category, under industry, industry, innovation and infrastructure, infrastructure pun is about, uh, infrastructure is more kepada system, infrastructure lah more like i'm thinking is more like on logistic and infrastructure tapi to my i think for first year i think we go for innovation eh? okay guys understand me okay we agree eh? we go for innovation any product you want we go for innovation because innovation is uh, ni. industry we have industry innovation and infrastructure okay you can go in the, in the innovation in terms of you for example like Previously, we give students how to do sorting machine. Uh, they also go for industrial innovation. Previously, we give to students major project. So, uh, sorting machine it is we give the student to pour in all the tetra pack in kotak air minuman, the the two water box, kotak air minuman tetra pack and eh? uh, like your sen, the, your your container box container water that you drink with straw tetra pack. Three tetra pack, empty tetra pack, and three water bottle, yang 1.5 milliliter small bottle plastic bottle and three aluminum can empty one okay pour into the feeder and do the sorting you mean when you pour into the feeder they mix together so nine of them in mix together but you punya machine can do able to uh, sorting it eh? uh, the uh, coin will go to can the three bottle go to three bottle container and the three tetra pack will go to three so they are they use their card that is also considered as innovation okay if you agree i can also maintain the team to be hands free do you agree on that I can be specific on hands-free device on your material. Are you listening, guys? Okay. Hands-free. Maybe I can still stick to the same hands-free device. It means our hand is full, so we can do something. Maybe hand is busy playing music instrument, or our hand is full, or maybe you want to avoid contagion. Alright, class, boleh eh? Okay? So, you focus dulu, okay? Tapi, that is I want to mention to you. I, I'm afraid, I don't want nanti you focus on minor project. Your minor project title that you choose is not totally relevant to your, nanti you later your major project title. So, it does not contribute. Make sure that your minor project really contributes. So, different title, you say motion transfer, timing device, trigger mechanism, and clipper device, feeding device. The one, the title that you choose, for the title be given to you. The product that you choose, does does really play well in terms of contribution because that is will be as your preparation knowledge your preparation because kita multidisciplinary I mean one of your expertise on motion transfer one of your expert on timing device one of you expert on trigger mechanism one of you expert on this feeding device one of you expert on this clipping device one of you expert on this object placing system so it's good eh? it's so good when you you uh, combine this you will your group will be strong eh? because you have expertise multidisciplinary on each area so you combine your group will be strong uh, so then after that you focus what title you can propose to me that that really play well in terms of under team innovation okay that's clear eh? that's okay right clear sir right okay so i go for attendant i think tomorrow point even kelah kita pun esok sambung kan tak apa right Sorry for taking my time, so we go for it and then we Are there questions for us? No, sir. Okay, see you tomorrow. Eh? Scan your attendance. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.